Welcome to this Windows and Computer channel and just a quick video to uh, talk about something that is of course part of Windows 10. It is your um, phone app. Your phone app is very very interesting because it makes it really easy to share pictures. You'll see typically the last 25 pictures that you've taken on your phone and this is nice. So here you see some of the latest pictures that I have. My cat and some uh, little pictures that I've taken here. Of course, uh, so you got the last 25, but you also have your messages. So basically, you also get your SMS or your text messages from your phone. And this is nice because it actually is a great way of sharing uh, the different things that you have. Now here it says we can't connect because my phone isn't on Wi-Fi. I've actually removed it off of my Wi-Fi, but it works really, really well and it's a great way to of course share the different pictures from your phone and also see the text messages which is cool because you can also answer text messages from the app so that means that you can actually um, answer without picking up your phone anybody that just texts you about something from within your PC which is nice and of course you'll get those uh, messages and the notification area if you want so your phone app is in your Windows 10 uh, May 2019 update. It's also part of the. Uh, um, it's also part of the. Um, basically, the um, October 2018 update, but it works. Uh, it adds s some functionalities and works a little better on the uh, latest version. What is also nice is you can easily share and save. Uh, if you right click a picture, you can easily save that picture to your um, device. So if you go into your phone app and you look at the different pictures, well you can actually right click and click save as, save your pictures within your computer. It will have the date and time stamp but you can give it whatever, um, you know, Paul the Cat for example in my case and so on uh, and save it to my PC which is very nice. So it's a nice add-on. A lot of people say, well, yeah, you know, but I just plug my phone or I... Well, here you don't have to plug it as long as your phone is connected to your Wi-Fi. And one last little thing that you'll need is that you'll need to have, of course, some Microsoft apps, including Cortana and, um, in, in, and the phone experience app from your Android phone or uh, iOS uh, iPhone device. It also works with tablets and uh, iPads. So, but you actually can do more with the uh, Android phone. If you got an Android phone, it's even better because it has more interaction. If you got an iPhone or an iPad, the problem is Apple actually shuts down the capabilities of external apps of doing things on the phone, so it doesn't work as well. But if you have um, the phone experience app from Microsoft on the Android device and uh, you use your phone app in Windows 10, both on the same Wi-Fi network and connected to the same Microsoft account, you will have that working. If you enjoy my videos, please subscribe, give us thumbs up. Thank you for watching.